Hi everyone, it's Miss Shermaine and it's great to see you today. I hope you're all doing good. I hope you've been playing a lot. I'm glad you joined me so we could read another great Bible story. Today our story is from the Old Testament. It happens before Jesus comes to earth. And our story is called Messages from God. God would sometimes um, talk to certain people on earth and then they would tell their people what God said. And there was a man named Isaiah and God would talk to him and then he would tell them what God said. He was called a prophet. And that's what, who our story is about today. It's in the Old Testament, Testament in the book of Isaiah. So let's get started. Now one day, a man named Isaiah had a dream about God. God sat on a throne like a king. He wore a long robe that filled the whole room. And next to God were angels with wings. As the angels sang, holy, 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 smoke filled the room and the house shook. An angel came over to Isaiah and touched his lips. Then God spoke. Who will talk to my people for me? Isaiah quickly shouted, I'll go, send me. Now Isaiah knew that God's people were not obeying God. God wanted Isaiah to tell the people to stop doing bad things and to do what was right. Isaiah told the people, but they would not listen. He talked to them for many, many years, and still they would not listen. Here's our picture of Isaiah when he's dreaming and the angels come to him. And there's God on his throne. God punished his people, but he did not give up on them. God never stopped loving them. God let Isaiah see what was going to happen in the future. God told Isaiah that someone special would be born who would teach his people how to live. Do you know who he was talking about? talking about Jesus being born in the future. Everything happened like Isaiah said it would because God talked to him and he told the people. God doesn't give up on his people. He never stops loving us. God will never, ever give up on you and me. Here's our last picture of Isaiah sleeping and God telling him about when Jesus would come and how Jesus would save us all. Isn't that special? God even gives messages to certain people and God talks to us. And even before Jesus came to earth, God told some of his special people that he would send a savior. I'm so glad God loved us so much. He loves us and that's why he sent Jesus to us. And because Jesus came, we can always talk to God and keep him close. We can always ask Jesus for help. And we can always tell them that we love them too. Let's pray to him now. 
Dear God, we're so glad that you talked to Isaiah. And we're so glad that even when your people didn't obey, you didn't give up on them. You kept loving them. Thank you for sending Jesus to all of us. We love you, God. Amen. Thank you for joining me for this very special story. I hope you all have a great week. And don't forget to talk to God whenever you want. Because he will love that. I'll see you real soon now. God bless you.